You know, I just got back from my vacation. This year I went up to the North Country, there's some friends up there. And there's a particular spot up there that is untouched by time, almost as if the Indians still live there. And there's a lake up there, and people come from miles around to visit this lake and drink in its beauty. Being North Country, the lake is half frozen all of the time, and this lake has an unusual legend about it. Up there, the old Indians will tell you the legend of the lake. The legend was related to me by a very, very old Indian chief. He said many moons ago, when the lake was very young, and before the white man came to inflict his logic and civilization on the red man, the only people who lived here were Indians. And the legend has it that a young Indian brave was in love with a young Indian maiden who lived on the other side of the lake. The Indian lovers never met. They never even saw each other because the lake was so vast. But every evening when the moon was bright, the young Indian brave would go to the edge of the lake and he would chant Indian love calls to the Indian maiden across the lake and she in turn would chant Indian love calls back to him. This went on for many years. Then one day the Indian brave could contain himself no longer. He had to meet his love. And so he jumped into the icy waters of the lake and started to swim toward his beloved. He swam about 10 feet out, froze and drowned. Until this very day, the legend notes that the lake still bears the name of that young Indian brave, Lake Stupid. <laughs>